This is ABC 27 News at 11. Good evening, I'm Alicia Richards. Valerie has the night off. To make sure you have a happy Labor Day weekend, you'll want to make sure you don't drink and drive. State police are ready with heavy patrols all weekend long. Jeremiah Marshall joins us in the studio. Jeremiah? Yeah, absolutely, Alicia. Officers with the Satara Township Police Department also say they know this Labor Day weekend is the last holiday of the summer and expect an increase of traffic. However, drivers can expect a police presence. According to PennDOT data, last year over 2,600 crashes resulted in 39 fatalities statewide over the Labor Day holiday week. 231 of those crashes resulted into 12 alcohol-related deaths. We at PennDOT want these numbers to be zero, and there should be zero. And they're not the only ones with this goal in mind. Lieutenant Dennis Kraling with the Swatera Township Police Department says drivers have choices for a smart and responsible way to get home. You have Uber and other things, take, take a cab, call friends. Um, there's various things you can do besides driving when you're impaired. Police officers say they are targeting two major things on the roadways, aggressive and DUI driving behaviors. We anticipate the drivers will do the proper thing, and if they do not do the proper thing, our officers will be out there to create enforcement. Uh, we hope that this is the year that uh, through this holiday season, we have zero fatalities here, not only throughout the township, but throughout the entire Commonwealth. And so patrol the roadways. Obviously, your, your major roadways, you'll definitely see us there, but we'll also be on the back roads as, as well. Anywhere that, uh, you know, we, we feel that we'll have increased uh, issues, whether through impaired driving or aggressive driving, uh, you can expect to see us with our township police officer. And officers also say as they become more aware with the police presence on this holiday weekend, they are par partnering with state police, PennDOT, and other local police departments. In studio, Jeremiah Marshall, ABC 27 News. Thanks, Jeremiah.